Hello friends of Marvel Heroes and friends of my channel. Welcome to another episode of uh, Q&A. I've got a lot of really good questions coming along, so I thought I'd share some of the answers with you. Uh, also, I'll be, I'll be playing not Rocket Raccoon, you'll see why in just a moment. Uh, a little bit on uh, Ghost Rider, I want to see how far he can push in terms of uh, time to kill in his uh, one of his specialization. Uh, infernal contract. So uh, there's a lot of stuff in this episode. I'd like to uh, share a lot of things with you. So first of all, uh, just uh, head to the question part. Um, so if you recall, uh, almost a year ago, I put up a guide called Raid Like a Pro uh, for those who need help on the first raid, the Sutor raid. Uh, back then, the gear requirement and right now the gear re requirement is a lot different. So I'm going to put some notes there uh, in case some of you have uh, just started a game and just watched my video working really hard towards the some of this really good gear. Uh, it is true, now the uh, with all the power creep and so on, you probably don't need that much gear if you have friends who are probably all, all stack, up with, stack up with gear. And uh, LFG is always, uh, I'll talk a little bit about that, uh, but LFG is always a little bit higher requirement than, than super group. So it's good to join a super group and uh, raid together. That's what my group do, does anyway. And the, um, I also talk about, I'll, I'll talk a little bit about the, you know, the commendation you can upgrade the gear to 66 and 69. So I think for new player, what to look out for and so on, I'll demonstrate live to you in just a bit. And the uh, uh, good question from, from uh, Nisrom as well on the uh, special item find and the rare item find. So I thought maybe I would like to talk a little bit about what are the nooks you could do, what are the enchantments you could do, or what are the core you can do kind of thing to make it uh, worthwhile, um, you know, to, to boost up your special item fund and rare item fund a little bit. Um, I, though I still think the best is different booster. And uh, yes, I'll be doing a um, you know, guide on Emma and, the, uh, and, and I think I heard a lot of good feedback on it. But when I did my guide for the best uh, heroes and team up for the new player, I have in mind something that is rather established already because, you know, sometimes newly revealed heroes, they may, they may nerve it a bit here and there. We never know, right? I mean, a lot of like changes may come along the way. I cannot just keep updating that part uh, so but you know if it happens to be one of the best heroes uh, for a new player so be it i would love to, to have that uh, you know emma to be in the list and um and yes uh, so selena has a question about the uh, the group uh, team up and the movie rocket raccoon team up so i i thought yeah i mean it's quite an interesting question so i i got rocket raccoon here so as you know rocket raccoon can summon Groot and if you purchase the uh, the movie edition of the uh, Rocket Raccoon the Groot will be the movie edition of the Rocket Raccoon however if you get the uh, team up for Rocket Raccoon and the uh, it would also be wow actually it's also two movie costume uh, Rocket Raccoon so it, it's pretty cool stuff man I mean uh, if you if you take away the costume uh, you could actually, I, I didn't know that actually I, I, I'm a bit uh, surprised so if you take away uh, okay reassemble the Groot how about that? Yep, so I don't know why this one remains as the uh, <laughs> the movie costume team up. Usually it's not the case, so you know, um, but yeah. So I think to answer Selena's question, yes, I mean, you know, if you if you have the uh, uh, movie costume for group, if you summon the group team up, you actually see another movie costume group as well, two of them, better than one. So now, uh, back to the, the whole thing about the, uh, the Ghost Rider. So I'm going to go back to Ghost Rider as well. And I've got my friend here with me, playing with me. And uh, it's uh, JS or ArtJS. Uh, I've been trying to ask people coming along, but I think it's, uh, you know, everybody has their own like farming to do. Okay, so I, I, I'm having like a Ghost Rider. Just uh, start with talk a little bit about the... Um, the so-called notes to watch out for if you want to boost your uh, special item find and rare item find. I like to boost this one XP by the way uh, when I'm still Omega raising. I'm still like not there yet. So um, you could get 10% uh, special item find from here and another 5% prop from here but that's about it. 15% uh, is what you can get from the, uh, from the Omega system for special item find. Uh, for rare item find wise, you can get like, you know, 10% here and another 20% somewhere here. So you get 30% uh, uh, rare item find. And you could also get some from the uh, Deadpool uh, team. Uh, Deadpool has 10% uh, here, right? So uh, you get another extra 10% for each one of them. So you get a little bit boost here uh, from the Omega system, a little bit boost from the uh, Synergy system. Uh, and how you find out all these, you know, um, 
rare item find and, uh, and so on is through one of these utility uh, that you can see the rare item find and this special item find and also I mean some of this gear will have uh, some something for you to sort of like you know uh, sometimes the gear of the hero may have the uh, special item find rare item find uh, but you know I, I think if you really want to push away of course you get a core that would uh, instead of plus 10 more credit because I think for me I'm more into credit uh, you could actually get um, you know plus 25% uh, uh, either rare item, rare item find like like this type right uh, special item find or rare, rare item find you know um, 25% so that I think 20 25 uh, that is one one option another option is of course head over here and do an enchantment so you can enchant um, the rare, rare item find right so that is the uh, rare, rare, rare item find and the uh, I believe that would be one uh, yeah so that is about it so you can get more credit or get rare, rare item find uh, that's it so special item find is quite special uh, so it's a little bit hard to you know you can get the plus plus five percent there and uh, if you want credit you can you can you can go for credit as well the wealth wealth uh, rune 20 percent so where do you get those uh, that's why i said uh, although gear and vendor is uh, is pretty useless but you know you can actually like you know uh, if you level to max rank when you roll it uh, there is a chance that the re the the recipe would come appear right now it doesn't but uh, there's a chance that it would right so yeah, no, I can't demonstrate to you, uh, but trust me, it's there. So, okay, uh, now I'm going to, I uh, hope to answer a little bit question on this uh, rare item find and whatnot. So now I'm playing Ghost, Rise, Ghost Rider, and I will be doing a guide soon. And the, um, uh, what is this? Uh? This is F, so I need to, uh, well, all the build, by the way, is not really finalized yet. So, uh, but it is almost there, but I haven't really, like, you know, uh, really looked through the numbers and so on. So, um. Well, I've looked through a number, but I'm I'm sort of like still perfecting my my rotation. So I'm going to solve like uh, this part of the where is my friend? I think Serpent Man is up there. So so my I, I'm going to um, just try uh, playing Ghost Rider in in a in a, in, in a way that uh, that is uh, going to sort of like drop my health to pretty low. And I want to see how doable is he when it comes to. Um, when it comes to playing the, um, you know, uh, all, all this uh, content, see whether it is possible to maintain a low health configuration. Because right now it's 20, 29k, but then when I use a buff, then uh, it is not so. So right now the lag is actually quite bad. Uh, so if I if I drop the thing like now, then now I become 14k, right? So the you know I, I'm doing a lot more damage. You can see the buff there thing. I got the contract infernal contract buff, uh, but that's about it. It's, it's actually quite. Um, uh, you know, I want to see how scary it is to, to have that um, uh, kind of thing. So yeah, okay, let me just go back to this mode. Okay, minus Titan, and the, um, uh, well, of course, you know, you do ultimate on this one. And then you can hold the shift key, and uh, the whole thing just keep like, you know, hitting this guy. <laughs> yeah, I know the screen is like, you know, really, really swinging like crazy. I, I don't know, man, do I, do I actually immune from all these things? Okay, good. So, uh, Signature and the um, and then this is infernal contract. So I want to see how many scary moments it will be if I if I do something like that. And the uh, yeah, all right. No, I think uh, I've got some some you know this, there's a bug somewhere. If I if I sort of like change my spec, all all these things become messed up. Um, you know, which which kind of like unfortunate. And the thing is just swirling. I don't know what happened to the whole thing. It's so funny. Uh, yeah, lag is lag, huh? I know what happened, man. It wasn't like that uh, for me. Hmm. All right. So, uh, are there any scary moments? And the uh, I'm sure. Um, well, yeah. Maybe it's not really the right kind of like um uh, place. Maybe I, I I I do a little bit more later on on the you know. Ooh. Okay, infernal contract. Okay. So that, that specialization I'm talking about is this guy here, Infernal Contract. So when I do that, my health dropped from 28,000 to 14,000, now, now back up again. So it works a little bit different from before, um, you know, pros and cons, I think this is quite a good design. Um, but I will talk a little bit more in the Ghost Rider uh, video that I will do in soon to happen. But uh, probably, um, yeah, I, mean, I, I don't know when I'll do it and the, uh, well, why do I want to do that? And, uh, so like, you know, I also learned that I should just like uh, keep keep cleaning my inventory while I'm doing this. <laughs> like, this reward is totally, you can't even sell the stuff, so why give it to me? I don't need that. All right, so let's see. 
And the, uh, I, I really like Ghost Rider, man. I mean, you know, I, I think uh, I finally cracked it. There's a Ghost Rider code. But, uh, okay, yeah, maybe, maybe, uh, oh, okay, maybe I talk a little bit about something else first before I talk too much about Ghost Rider. I have to stop myself talking about Ghost Rider because I need to have something to say during the three videos I'm going to produce in just a bit. Um, tomorrow is the, tomorrow is the uh, server uh, maintenance I think so I would not be able to uh, do any video on, on, on that a little bit unfortunate uh, but um, all right uh, so I, I think I don't know what I'm gonna do tomorrow man so I will not be able to make a guy so soon but um, as and when I can I will all right so that is uh, that's my promise I know there's a lot of Ghost Rider fans who has been asking if I could help out a little bit on um, yeah so okay let me just collect stuff here yeah, so what I would do, uh, I'll talk about the unique update, but uh, that is a unique uh, upgrade to 66 and 60, 69, and how you compare the stat and so on. But uh, just uh, have, uh, wait, wait for me, probably towards the end when I have more, uh, when I have more unique to so I talk about. <laughs> yeah, and right now there are many, right? So uh, let me see, where is my friend over there? All right, so I'm just going right over there. You know, back in the old day, Actually, there was a ride build in the patrol. You can just max out all this ride and things just die kind of thing. So it's rather cute and fun, actually. Like, it's pretty funny. All right, uh, there's no more. Uh, what, what do I have to do here? Let me, let me think. Um, like, like I'm trying to do some balls here. Wow, my orbs, man. You know what they should do in this game? They should just increase the orb ab absorption kind of like, you know, uh, orb, orb kind of like uh, attraction radius by a great deal. Like they probably by by five hundred percent. I think that would probably make this game really fun to play. At least for me, uh, not sure about Gasilian ones or not. So, uh, well, okay. Why why do I do this? Okay, let me just. Okay, so there are a couple of things I would like to talk about. Uh, I'm not quite sure whether you have uh, paid attention to what happened to the forum. Uh, but uh, suddenly the forum changes. Uh, it's been something that I've been asking for a very long time. Uh, believe it or not. Oh, there's Electra here. So low health. Uh, so I've been, it's something that I've been asking a lot is that uh, no, when, when, I, when I go to the forum, I actually don't really fancy the whole uh, disagree kind of thing. I, I, it is like, um, you know, some, sometimes, and I, I think you, know, you have interacted with me through YouTube and everything. I, I'm a more, I mean, you know, I think, I, think I, I intend to discuss matters and so on rather than, you know, debate or, you know, because, that, you know, a lot of time there's no right or wrong answer. There's always like, what happened? Did I just... Yeah, so that, that answered a question. I don't know what happened. I, I didn't even see what happened. <laughs> Did he just die or something from Elytra? Wow, amazing. So yeah, I mean, uh, in the forum now, you cannot do disagree and you cannot do LOL, uh, laugh out loud. So why is it so? I do not know. And the, uh, But it's something that I've been asking for because I, you know, sometimes I, I think the whole disagree thing make people a little bit on the on, on the side that is uh, rather uh, how should I say you know uh, they may they may they, they may um, be a bit uh, you know uh, you know sometimes they, they may just disagree uh, because someone disagree with them and they feel that they should just give it back to them kind of thing so I, I always find that a little bit strange the whole disagree thing and the uh, I mean you know if you disagree you just tell people what you feel about it you know rather than just like hit a disagree and then disappear kind of thing um, so I thought, yeah, I mean, it's always nice to, um, you know, not to have that, I think, at least from my perspective. Uh, so, uh, finally, they do not have that, and they do not have LL. Uh, but then, i also been thinking, like, you know, is it really, I mean, what do you guys think? Do you like, um, you know, do you, do you actually miss the disagree thing? Because right now, it's kind of annoying. Uh, how people disagree is just type the word, I disagree, right? So, just to show that I have an opinion to give. Because now that I cannot click on the disagree button, I make sure that my, my thought, my opinion is being heard. So we are in this era whereby a lot of people just would like to be heard in terms of from an opinion perspective. So I don't know, it's kind of strange because uh, it, it kind of, you know, we have, we have a different type of behavior now. Uh, as you can see that people become, um, because I think when, when, when there was a disagree, uh, people tend to be a bit, um, you know, uh, I would say, nice to each other uh, because uh, you also wouldn't want to make a you know, like scene and then everybody just disagree and then you have like 
hundred disagree while talking about something, and the uh, and people tend to build relationship in a way hoping that uh, that you know people will be more tolerant in terms of uh, listening to each other, uh, agree or disagree. But uh, I also feel that uh, by not having that uh, people somehow that is that that kind of um, you know uh, I mean okay so back in the old day you know that. People may abuse that, become like a like a re- revenge. So because you disagree with me, I sort of like I don't like it, and I would like to disagree with you, um, just for the sake of disagreeing, right? But uh, now it's kind of strange. Now it's that like everybody can just say something strange and you know funny, not funny. I mean you know just uh, not too pleasant. Uh, but because there's no disagree penalty, so people just say something not that pleasant. So I don't know, man, how you guys feel about it. Well, we'll see. I mean, we'll see. I don't know. So uh, let me let me take a look at this guy here. All right. So I, I deliberately want to take some damage as well because I I want to see how how well that uh, Ghost Rider can hold with the uh, with the low health kind of thing. So you know uh, don't get disappointed if if suddenly see uh, my Ghost Rider dead like you know just a melt in a second kind of thing. All right. So uh, wow, this I don't know why the lag is so bad. Uh, I mean uh, I don't usually have this kind of lag in High Town. Strange man, strange thing happened. So Kingpin is out, and uh, I think after this round, I would, uh, I would uh, change my uh, spec, not change my spec. Sorry, uh, I, I would uh, change my build. I have three builds, and I want to test them all out in one shot. Besides, I would like the Phantom Gear, but uh, it doesn't seem that I farm a lot of gears. Hmm. Yeah, but there's the double job. Uh, cosmic the. Chaos always a good time to farm unique and XP. I think it give, it will give you the best XP. Uh, I think because it's being double the orbs and so on. Although the um, yeah, al although the um, the XP um, bonus is not as high, but I I, I think it in a way uh, because of the double kind of. Um, uh, drop then even the ops are double so you know that should be pretty decent so I don't know we'll see about we'll see to that but I mean it dropped three you need each of them is uh, having a challenge point challenge bonus basically you know what I mean guys I don't I don't play anywhere anymore uh, I don't go anywhere anymore it's just the high town patrol because I mean you know un unless they have uh, you know un unless they have uh, improved the loot to say that wherever you go doesn't really matter uh, you still get get a dub plus one you know to to the uh, uh, to that um, uh, yeah to to you know plus one to uh, to 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 the uh, to all the challenge pawn the unique gear I mean I wouldn't really want to go anywhere really I mean do you guys go anywhere other than the, uh, cosmic high town I mean what what is the point of doing the other thing than cosmic high town right and uh, oh, wow for some reason I have to go really fast to the other side all right man ride. Let's ride there, right? And uh, I'll talk a little bit more about that uh, kind of like um, somehow the mini boss doesn't seem to spawn as fast. I don't know why. Yeah. Okay. Just on time to uh, to, to. All right. This is signature, and that's it. Gordon. The lag is crazy. Maybe just Ghost Rider. Oh man, this is uh, okay. So I've got quite a quite a number of stuff, and I'm quite happy about it. But I wish it's more. So I'm going to, uh, right here, I'm going to change my spec. I hope I could change my... Okay, so I'm going to all range now. This range build. And oh, I need to somehow map again. I still haven't... F1. F2 is my right. No, F2 is my CC breaker. F3 is my right. All right, so... Okay, uh, that is probably the... Oh, yes, I don't know whether you have to check out the... The uh, test center. Some of the new changes coming on board. Uh, well, I mean, you know, I, I think they're going to push another uh, another patch somehow. But uh, what is new would be the uh, would be the um, the tuning of the boss, and I find it quite interesting. Let me just try something else here. I'm just like, as you can see, I'm still trying, and the uh, yeah, okay, so. Um, so I, I think they are going to make all the bosses uh, the same kind of, um, um, you know, it's the same same kind of uh, tuning to it. So you know, right now if you play this game, some of the bosses are just so weak, right? If you if you farm like Cosmic Terminal, uh, they they are just so like in one shot or two shot and, and, and the boss is down. Uh, it, it's kind of to a point whereby the it, the boss is just so weak. It doesn't kind of make sense. So. 
I think they are trying to make all all game content uh, as rewarding because now you know some of these like uh, rare art artifact it dropped from any bosses as well. So in a way, I can understand. Oh, I might have a splinter there, and uh, I need to pick up something up up there as well. Okay, so that is uh, fury. It's there. So I'm going to have a lot of fun uh, with uh, with uh, Nick Fury. Nick Fury actually hit very hard, so this is a very good place for me to test my uh, DPS survivability. All right. Okay, rotation time. So, and I I, I think it's uh it's tough, but it's nice to to have the uh, you know what? Let me just do ultimate here again. It's nice to, to have all the bosses to be roughly the same kind of like, you know, uh, difficulties. Otherwise, you just get, get into too simple. But I really hope that, okay, so there will be no change to raid, uh, which is, I think it's good news. Because sometimes raid is so, so, uh, su such a chore in the sense, uh, you really won't want that to be any longer. Uh, so, yeah, and the, uh, but I think my only concern is whether Cosmic Gate would be made harder uh, if that's the case then it's going to be quite quite uh, quite this quite disadvantage I think I think if that's the case I better make sure that all my heroes pass the gate I mean I, I haven't really got chance to do all the heroes not that I can't I suppose it but it just I don't have time to to do a cosmic cosmic gate actually is pretty boring for them someone who has done it for all he I mean, almost all heroes so I think maybe I'll need to bring some of the heroes uh, into cosmic gate just to they pass it before it's too, too high. I don't know, man. I mean, some heroes are not really that strong. You know, you have to agree with me. And the uh, and, and Cosmic Gate is not really good for all these heroes. Anyway. And the... Uh, what is this? Uh, no. I don't need that. Uh, Modoc. <laughs> Modoc, man. How, when, when would... I would I love to play Modoc, really. Uh, but uh, medallion-wise... Um, Penance. Uh, Penance. And the... Uh, what else do I, do I have to... Can I throw away? I mean, this game is uh, okay. Good stuff. So that is the that is the one that uh, that I would like to talk about. And uh, oh, Gordon is there as well. So let me just uh, head over there. I have a feeling that I have to sort out my inventory really soon. Okay, man. Infernal contract. Okay. So this is like um, I have an arrow stone there, and I think I lost a splinter already. It disappeared somehow. So I always get distracted and so like you know forget to, to take something. Okay, I've got the bosses there, so uh, I'm going to go there. Yeah, so the range build, I don't know man, the range build doesn't that seems that exciting for me. Um but uh, I will do a so like you know Wow a couple of them and the uh Okay man Thor is here. Okay, let me just grab all this up. I'm still doing my Omega Omega kind of like wow Yeah Wow, this is actually quite quite a quite a hectic kind of thing, huh? Okay, man, let me just like um, do what I do best, which is the area damage here. I I, I always like the uh, the damnation. I know the damnation the the DPS is pretty pretty pathetic, but uh, I always like how damnation works. Mm. Whoa, thought I thought for a moment uh, he died already, but anyway, okay. Uh, so let me just get get my bearing right. Okay, now it's uh, now it's in business. So okay, uh, let's talk about a little bit differently. Uh, I don't know whether you guys have um, you know, some of you guys may be playing World of Warcraft. Uh, there is recently a newsletter from them uh, saying that uh, the expansion of the, well the last expansion is free, uh, and also they will give a booster to to level level. Um, 90 free as well so i thought yeah i mean i, I call my friend as well they are all very excited and interested um well because some of us have been playing world of warcraft for like many many years including my wife uh, really really many years i've been doing it since that like, launch and i've been like playing it since like um you know like uh i mean i stopped already my wife joined at the, at, at the uh, burning crusade uh, where the blood elf is you know was there so i thought yeah i mean i thought it'd be quite interesting to to, to revisit this weekend to see what, you know how how different or how the same it is so we, we always joke that we have uh, we have a panda which got stuck in a in a very low level because I mean panda man I, I can't really take a panda seriously uh, <laughs> yeah so uh, but uh, I think you know maybe we should give it a go uh, to see 
you know how how, how that turns out I, I i don't know man i i'll probably post something i don't know uh we will probably play like a noob, like, you know, where are the things? And the, um, it will be a fun time. And quite a number of our friends also get excited. I thought it's pretty smart of, uh, you know, Blizzard to do that, um, to bring people back in a little bit, um, you know, to, 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 the, to the family of Blizzard uh, before they launch the, um, of course, they launch over Overwatch. Uh, so I thought that that is pretty, um, you know, uh, smart of them to do such a thing. I mean, uh, for some of us who has been paying for years um, on the subscription, what is the expansion, right? The cost is actually very minimal, uh, but you got to, you know, at least uh, some statistic to, to cheer about and the uh, condemn. I don't do condemn anymore. Uh, maybe just pop on there. All right. So I would like to... I can't. Come on, man. This guy is so annoying. I would like to change my spec to something else and the... Um, hmm. Come on, let me let me do it, man. Really, let me let me change. No, ah. change back is so hard. Okay, let me see. Come on, activate, activate. No, I can't. Fine, I can't. I want to show you the other spec, which I actually like it a lot better than uh, than what I see here. <laughs> this I'm asking for trouble here. In a in a fourteen health, uh, fourteen thousand health. This is not going to be well. Well, yeah, so uh, this weekend, uh, I will spend like probably like the whole entire weekend just, you know, wow, good old day of, uh, of a World of Warcraft and see what, uh, what we can make of, we'll take our panda to, to immediate level 90 and see whether we can level it to 100 within a week, <laughs> probably not. I mean, that game is still quite a while to, to grant it to, I think, I don't know, you guys can tell me, some of you guys are playing the game as well, alright. Okay, uh, so that is all, and uh, yes, I uh, I don't know whether you guys noticed or not. I actually spend a lot of time doing raiding these days. I'm making new friends, and I don't know why I stay out of the raiding scene for for quite some time. For probably because I, I don't know. I mean, sometimes I lost interest in the whole raiding scene because uh, the requirement is always so high, which I always find it a little bit unrealistic, and people don't seem to be quite patient. But uh, after a while, I mean, I've got friends as well. I'd like to acknowledge them. Uh, probably in my next guide, I raid like a pro uh, for the access rate like a pro, uh, which I hope to come up uh, in a couple of weeks time. I just want to master it, some screenshot as well. And uh, it's, it's kind of fun as well. I mean, you know, there, there are people who are looking for requirement that is really, really high. And the, uh, uh, but you know, I, I wanted to take my rook there, uh, knowing that my rook actually do better than my magic, I think, uh, even with the great 70 legendary. But because since they all ask for great 70 legendary, uh, great 80 legendary, so I thought, you know, well, you know, I, I probably have to go in with my with one of my heroes that has a uh, AT, a legendary, you know, just because they want to see AT. And I look around, I mean, that do, do people actually have that kind of like gear? I mean, yeah, I mean, I saw a rook that has um, that has a great AT shield. So I thought, wow, I mean, why do a shield? But anyhow, I mean, everybody can bring in any great AT. They just want to see AT. So, but uh, I mean, I, I guess if you are a rook and you get a great AT shield, you can afford to to uh, be really aggressive in your passive, I guess. But again, it wouldn't work for my build, so I wouldn't be too, like, you know, uh, thinking too much about that. Um, but I had, a, I had a tremendous amount of fun uh, to for the whole raiding. Um, it, it seems to me that at least it makes things up a little bit. Uh, I can do, like, you know, um, you know, high town, I can do a little raiding. So, you know, that, that, that's cool. I, I'm happy. I'm actually pretty pretty delighted that um, get back to the scene again and join those like high tier rate that they will ask you for the maximum count of like a spare and maximum count of everything just to do access. And after that, guess what? Uh, we went to the red rate, which is so easy that it seems like a green rate, like a really green rate. When the green rate is not was down like within seconds, like you know five seconds, I don't know. Then it's just down. The rate boss is down. Everybody's gear is so good. It is a tremendous overkill, and then there was one guy who wanted to join us. He doesn't know the, uh, the you know, doesn't know the fight. I mean, I, I admire him, man. I mean, he's really honest. Uh, so he said that you know he he has some red ray, he has for for the sutu ray, green sutu ray. Uh, but you know, I mean, to be to be frank, when when the when the leader asked asked for people, he he was actually asking people who has done it before, know the fight. So basically, this uh, you know this new player probably. You know the fight, of course, and being very uh, honest about it, which I very much admire the kind of honesty. Uh, but of course, you know when when you're that honest and your gear is not really what they're looking for, and do not really look, 
I mean, you know, then, I mean, we could have carried him through the access, I'm pretty sure. But in the end, you no, know, uh, he got kicked out. But that's, that's reality. That's why I don't really like to go with the, uh, the whole uh, looking for group because it just sometimes it's just so, so cruel. But then, on the, on the other hand, is that if you have done it so many times and the, uh, you just want to get over and done with. So if you have a whole team of very uh, pro people uh, that do not need to talk at all uh, in the entire fight, uh, it, it is a, it is fun as well because you, you don't really get to worry about do, do I know what the person is doing because you can trust each other but you also get a little bit of stress uh, you try not to die in the ray because after that uh, otherwise it's so obvious because the death count is very very low in that kind of setting um, so everybody is watching out and try not to be the only one with the only death count over there right so it'd be Pretty hilarious. I mean, for for the access boss, we didn't even get to use the ultimate twice, so that is pretty pretty awesome. So I, I will I will do a guide on that and um, and uh, help you guys out, uh, especially for those who has not seen uh, access. And uh, you could tell people that I've seen it because you watch my video, Ray like a pro access, which is coming soon, and equip you with all the information you need, and nobody will can ever tell whether you've been the access way or not. That is my goal anyway, to do all this video. And the last thing is the, to help you guys out on the, um, some of you new player to de determine whether you should keep or, or throw away some unique. So you know, you know, you can do a whole alt key there. Uh, the unique will tell you the, uh, wow, this unique actually is pretty good. I should do a plus one fighting on this one. <laughs> Anyhow, you could, you could do a whole alt key and then you can see like, you know, how many percent of the range. So. Um, when, when you do unique upgrade from 63 to 66 to 69, uh, what happens is that the percentage will stay the same. If it's the number, like, you know, right now it's 536 five, crit rating. But I, but I reckon, you know, when it was a grade 63, it, it was uh, below that 400 odd maybe, right? 400 or below 400. So when you upgrade a weapon, it, everything, it doesn't reroll. Don't worry about it. You don't need to think whether you upgrade or not. If you think that it is better, then you upgrade. But there are some exceptions to it. Uh, the, the, the rank to all power is only from 66 to 69 that you know become plus extra rank to all power but uh, plus rank to a certain like for instance the uh, the third last one plus three ranks to all power is due to the 66 to 69 plus seven rank it was a plus six but because of the upgrade from 66 to 69 become plus seven then the health beam health fire beam actually started with plus five then you go to 66 then you plus another extra then 60 you know and, and plus another extra to to seven after you upgrade, upgrade 69 so um some some are upgraded uh, some are not uh, you know just have to take no experiment about it and uh like like some some gear you can see that's uh, some red red zone here so the whole idea of farming is to find gear to to to, to better this one so whenever you you find a gear it's actually quite hard to um quite hard to decide like for instance this spike here so what you do is that you compare the percentage uh, because the absolute number changes as you upgrade the um, the unique from 66 63 to 66 to 69 so you can't really compare it so when I, when I look at this one here, um, you know, I, I've got, um, you know, my, my, my currently equipped one is actually quite poor because the crit and the brutal is very low. Uh, but it has the plus three to all power and then, you know, plus five to Ghost Rider, that one is zero percent. So, you know, uh, so it's not that great, but uh, Spirit of Vengeance is pretty high. Um, the, you know, shall I equip the one on the left or shall I, you know, keep the one on the right? I think I would go for, because, well, it's a lower, uh, damage rating on the vengeance power of course that is less ideal right so I, i'm losing a, a bit but then i get a higher crit and higher higher brutal and also i get like you know um my spirit of vengeance uh, which is this one here the 50 uh will be will not be uh 50 anymore uh but maybe it's is ideal uh, you know maybe i don't need that i don't know uh but then i get to have all the ghost rider vengeance power plus plus five so you know uh kind of thing so this is a vengeance so um in the end, it doesn't really matter because you got all this, uh, you know, plus, plus, you know, you get, oh, hang on, where is it? Uh, you can see that um, from ranging point of view, it's either plus five or rank, or, you know, kind of like, so what you can do is to upgrade it and you, you can see what happened in just a moment. And uh, if I upgrade, this is uh, slot five. So no, no brainer, just like, um, you know, 10,000. 
Uh, so you upgrade this guy, and, and this one you see all the percentage for 955, and it's the same thing, right? So it's for 955, but, then, but the absolute number has gone up, uh, if you notice. And next one will boost the rank of the plus 2 to plus 3 all power, plus 5 to plus 6 uh, venture power. So, and the, uh, then I can use the other recipe to upgrade this one, and the... Um, and, 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 and this one will become like, uh, you, know, uh, you know, 6 plus 3 is 9. Uh, yeah, so so what it really means is that my Spirit of Vengeance may come down, uh, but I got a challenge bonus. So, you know, you can see, uh, you know, it doesn't come down. So, you know, it's good. So you, you, you sort of like to monitor all this, like, you know, rank as well. Uh, so all this, but I mean, does it really matter so much? It doesn't really matter because I've got like, you know, all this max rank anyway equip that or not but I mean these are something that you have to go into your mind and, and, and constantly thinking sure you sure or not and I, I don't suppose any of this will, will be better than, than the one I have so you know instantly you go into the blender for watch credit chest so I have uh, 200 in the bank and now I have another 100, 185 so I'm hitting 200 million soon in credit I hope my real life have that much then uh, yeah let me compare all these things also bear in mind that things like uh, like the um, you know that, that sometimes they have plus one plus one fighting or whatnot or plus one you know intelligence on the on the s on the stair it will not get scaled up so those things will not get scaled up um, so certain things get scaled up but some ally damage a flat percentage usually what you see a flat percentage it will not go up uh, like the uh, chance to proc those will not go up so no change even if you upgrade so just bear in mind and that kind of philosophy applies to uh, medallion as well if you if you upgrade like sinisters medallion you probably don't see anything change uh, but you upgrade other medallion yeah i mean you know you could you could actually see some of these uh, changes um into a higher higher kind of step so i hope that will answer that question about the unique update and yeah that's it uh, that's really all thank you very much for watching and uh, oh you know what um before i uh, you know what let me just do one more man uh, if you don't mind uh, let me just remap again this is f1 f2 and f3 so if you don't mind uh, i would like to also share a little bit about this uh, this this build here and the uh, and uh, okay, so where's everybody? Um, where's my friend? Magia is there. So usually I'll just take this opportunity to see where the someone. Wow! I'm in luck, man. Come on, man. This is like that from above. So this is one of the builds that I'm actually excited myself, uh, to be honest, when I when I play it. Uh, this one is, is actually. Because I find it very exciting. The Right now, the. the wow! Oh, hang on. <laughs> I want to just uh, grab something, man. Okay, man. Oh, death from above. Yeah, then you can burn the burn the track or whatnot. Okay, so King Bean is there. So my buddy is already there. My buddy, you know, JS, and he probably found, wondering why am I so quiet today? Is this guy having a bad day? No, actually, I'm having quite a good day. Quite a tired, tired day though. I mean, now it's almost like you know, um, almost Friday. Usually, I I get a little bit like you know, uh, I mean, my work is also quite um, quite demanding sometimes. So. Yeah, I can do another one. Wow, get away from that one. All right, judgment, burn the trap, inferno. Okay, another death from bow. Whoa, this is like, man. I mean, this is the exciting factor of playing uh, Ghost Rider. Whoa, look at the bite that all the way in. Son of the Anarchy, probably not. Um, yep. So that's it. Okay, let me just uh, loot my stuff. And yeah. Oh yeah, I mean, uh, also some of you talk, I mean, I, I interact quite a number of you in Steam as well, and uh, thank you for adding me in Steam. It's a lot easier to get me in Steam because sometimes when I'm at work, hope none of my colleagues is really listening to my video. But when I'm at work, sometimes I get, uh, you know, I want to connect. I don't do Facebook, I don't do any other social media, so YouTube is the only thing I have, and Steam as well. So I would like uh, just... Um, you know, chat with some of you all uh, from other time zone that I would otherwise not able to. One, two, three, four. Then penance. All right, man. No, penance is very strange. Sometimes it doesn't fire off. It kind of like make me a little bit mad, to be honest. And burn the trap. Now it's so cool, man. You don't need to hold the thing, man. You can just. And uh, whoa, man! Look at the bike. It's fantastic. Those who like bikes, right? Man, this is fantastic stuff, man. I, I mean, uh, I'll talk a little bit more about DPS wise in just a bit. All right, so that was a CC breaker. <laughs> okay, uh, well, there's one more. So I'll do one more last wave, and that's about it. I will not like you know overstretch this video. But I thought this video is kind of uh, it's a lot of thing to cover. So I hope uh, you find it quite fun to watch as well. It's a lot of you know bubble on the side, but I can't take them. You know why? Because if I get out of the scene, I would likely not 
uh, lose all the loot. It's just how this game works. You have to be around somewhere and the world's trying to click onto it as well. Okay, last way for you guys. And uh, well, I mean, let's do the <laughs> let's do the ultimate mate. Yeah, and the uh, oh yeah, I mean uh, the reason why I talk about the steam is that sometime I I saw I talk to you all and you all tell me uh, the, your 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 life as well. Some of you are uh, I think one of you work in a you know medical industry and the uh, some some of you actually you know do um, uh, English literature or literature in general, and it's really cool uh, to to talk to many people from around the world. So uh, I think I think one of the you know, some, sometimes we talk about the movie, sometimes we talk about the books. So one of the books that I'm reading right now is actually a, a Spanish kind of like book. It's called the... Uh, I don't know whether you can see or not. It's, it's this one here. All right. So it is, it is called uh, The Full Woman, Fleshy Apple, Hot Moon. Uh, it is from uh, Pablo Neruda, which is supposed to be someone famous. Um, and it's great because the book actually has, uh, has two sides to it. One is the Spanish words uh, that I've learned in the past with my wife uh, and she's of course a lot better when it comes to linguistic ability uh, man being man right so I play games instead um, but uh, you know it, it's really good because I, I could actually read the words and I can I, I, I remember some of the words and the um, and, and it, it helped me to refresh my memory on what, what some of those words uh, mean so yeah I mean I enjoy a lot uh, of this, this book um, do check it out if, if you like kind of like literature and you know Spanish kind of thing um, yeah and it's funny is that uh, I actually spotted uh, one mistake uh, from, from, from the publisher and it's kind of strange like you know you shouldn't make a mistake because it was talking about I, I think the, uh, the Spanish word was December December and uh, they, they translate to I think June or something like that so it's strange uh, strange very strange so anyhow uh, that is all and the uh, whoa Nick Fury is the next wave and uh, Nick Fury is always uh, one of the best wave because uh, it may drop something fantastic so uh, I would continue playing this with my friends and the, uh, thank you very much for watching and I hope you got a chance to farm something great as well I mean now nowadays Marvel Heroes uh, is, 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 is a game of uh, Cosmic High Town as well as uh, weekly rate, and that's what I do. All right, so uh, hope to join, hope to uh, hope you guys to join with me um, some other days and uh, play some games together. All right, ping me. Uh, sometimes I don't really get your message because I'm recording. That's all. Have a great day. Goodbye.